Okay, on a couché, on a cabo. These are the World Body Better Pass Gentry program. We are selling as them across the world. We don't learn different things them. Now then they present, uh, they bring this presentation to now. I just don't see, um, I make a mistake on the end. <laughs> 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 on the is it 022? Uh, <laughs> 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 Unfortunately, nobody knows notice this. Anyway, it's the 22nd of May, 2022. And today we deal with full portion size and control. Basically, we they look today as to how people in they will, um, how for a balance with diet, but we'll look at the portion and where we they eat. Um, so the food we eat, yes, it's healthy, but we get for be careful of the portion and sizes. But hey, me not a professional for that. Me, I maybe me own plates can be past everybody else, you know. So until Fatima away na in profession, this na will take me through today. Try for teach me what it and how we for eat. Okay, so until Fatima na uh, in go explain to one how I be, he go give a brief introduction of who I be, what he qualify and what he do. Me na me name Timu John Fuller, na me na the host. Uh, me not qualify in eating. The only eating I qualify for eat. And maybe so they make like life food for see how they eat. All right. Okay, so we can kick off. Um, what have they said before? The group a makeup of different people um, from various background, from various uh, professional and field. We get some um, um social workers, we get doctors, we get we, even within the doctors, we get emergency doctors, we get general practitioners, we get pharmacists, we get pediatrics, we get um what do they call them? The the woman doctor them. What do they call it again? Come on, help me with my name again. Gynecologist. Uh, Gynecologist. That's the one. Ah, you know, <laughs> as I said, we get a lot of people there. <laughs> you see, I just want to make sure say when all the pay attention and on all the you know they follow it in the app. I'm like I say, we know now you know they get paid. Everything we do, they do I'm out of the goodness of your heart for that way we will benefit to people and, and they show they get done in. <laughs> You know, means if you ask question in English, no go answer you. The only thing to make you do I'm in Creole now for low provide that holistic um, um explanation for people. We some man they you know before doctor, we don't talk all the big, big English them, you know. The problem we go with too, plus which is not can tell you, plus the English now you the commodity you don't understand. But if we able to break things down for, for people in Naya, you get able to know waiting for look out for if something wrong and we go doctor, how you for explain yourself and what you for expect what happen. But do you have me when they give individual advice now? Yeah, and general advice will they give you. Need individual advice, you get for see your doctor or physician. Whether they be able to look at the results, then we don't we don't take for you for they able to decide what is the best course of action and how for treat you. Okay. Like I've been saying before, <clears throat> we get YouTube channel, we get Facebook, and we get um, for which house to we so then we can be on Facebook Live. Unfortunately, this one only on Facebook Live today, but normally we can be on Facebook. But once you all the version we've done do before, please go on YouTube. We get a lot. Um, as soon as I can see the the the, the stage we're reach now, we're only now for two years. There's a lot of people. You are big if you didn't have a place with noise, you meet yourself, please. Okay. So now the public say before the end, everybody will get a chance to ask questions. And what you can do if you go to the bottom of your screen, if you look now, they get three dots them, you press on that in the you can either use this for chat for same questions if you're not comfortable for um, talk or maybe also ID in noisy. So you can use the chat. You can chat normal just like I do on WhatsApp. Okay. The other thing you can raise your hand using this. If you're not having use this, no worry. It's your normal physically. If I see you, I'll come to you. If I don't see you quick, I'll not come to you quick. You know, I mean, ignore. It just means say maybe I don't see you quick. Okay. So now the candle now over to Auntie Fatima we can take on today. Do the session. Um, if you want to send any comments, suggestion, feedback, anything you want to send, I can send them by email. The easy make me say I'm by email is that we will call later, you know, at any point in time, it's maybe three months or six months, we can see them. Look at all them comments here and try for make improvements. If that's until we will do now, we can do it now, but as until we need for do, as in how we conduct things, we can look at them at a three months basis. Okay, so that's all for me today. And Fatima, over to you. Thank you, Uncle John. Okay. So, okay, and are they able to see yeah? Yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay, on a question, and welcome to me um, talk today uh, um, about healthy eating, uh, food portion size, then, and control. 
So as um, John, Uncle John Don explained, a really important mark we understand um, the balance of the food way we they eat. Um, although we food healthy, although you know it uh, contributes to you know we, we well body, a really important mark we understand say even if we they eat too much of one thing, it, it's not good for we. So a really important mark we understand this. So now I go go through the discussion point then for today in presentation. So the first discussion point where we go talk about now the within at the time food portion size. So I go ask you a question. The first part of the session it will be interactive. So I go ask you a question, please. When I feel free um, for interact with with you, they ask. Then the other parts now um, for understand the energy balance. What you mean? And then the effects where portion size gets on the weight. So how it affect them? And then also we go look on um, weight gain and, and disease. So how, you know, when when they gain weight, how the affect, you know, on our body. Then we go look on portion sizes for the, com the, the common food that we they eat in our community and the amount where we did for, you know, um, put in our plates. And then the other one where we go look on now the methods where we go use for control with portion sizes. Now, now then then now we go focus on. And then I go give us some tips then on how um, when I go able for portion control um, as well. So all of these things then could be um, you know good thing then for for when I for understand what to they for do. Okay, so as always, I bring this um, quote: prevention is better than cure. Uh, that the same meaning as well, body better past gentry. So of course, even though today uh, we know they you know talk about uh, specific disease, we could see say that um, if we they eat boku tin, then in general, whatever that might be, the food that we would eat, we still differ balance on in order for prevent any disease um, as well. Okay, so now we're going to the question then. Okay, so um, I can't ask you now. Waiting on the things say, um, you know, food portion size, you mean to, to now. What do you, what do you mean? You don't have an oversized portion. Okay, yeah, thank you, Anne. So no, no oversized portion, the right amount, just the right amount. Thank you, Anne. So, um, since I'm done telling her that, that, that they mean, waiting, somebody gets some other meaning, where then one add. So, waiting food portion size mean? For me, it means as well, even if you don't cut a certain portion of size, where you feel really good for you, where you don't get to buy full, so you get for finish, and where you feel full up, stop. Mm -hmm. Yes, standing are also good um, suggestion there, Uncle John. So, it not so, it means say, if you know, sometimes we we be guy. So when we angry, we go think say we therefore eat the food where we don't put now we plate. But sometimes, as you eat the food, you go you know sometimes you go feel say or oh, I don't very full. So, so you know therefore continue just because you know you don't put on at your plate. You go save them for later. Um, but yeah, done a really good um thing where you add there as well. Okay, so then the next question where I want to ask now. now um, if I think say that um, you know food portion sizes than the more at supermarkets, maybe in a restaurant or uh, place them where they go um, out for eat, when they think say um, you know the portion sizes then don't increase, then don't you know become bigger over the years, or you think say then don't reduce? I think they've gone bigger. Okay, <laughs> yeah, yeah, and you think that, and and why do, you, yeah, and and why do you think they've gone bigger? Because it's the they're adding things on to the to the actual mm -hmm. menu mm -hmm. to make mm -hmm. the meal bigger. That's great. Thank you, Anne. Yeah. So um I think the, the thing is is that when you do go out, they will sometimes add um extras. So you know, then they push enough for, for you know order something else on the side of an our main meal. So yes, then yeah, it's true, Anne. Yeah, thank you very much. Um other people then get idea if then things they then portion size them increase or then small. Now it yes. depends who's on day. Yes, now Germany, for instance, um, mm -hmm. we actually see say they try for reduce mm -hmm. and portion mm -hmm. sizes um, compared to other places like England or America. You can find out say if you go like at McDonald's, the portion mm -hmm. size is definitely smaller in Germany than 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 America mm -hmm. or England. 
Okay, fantastic. Thank, thank you, Uncle uh, Dr. Bell. So then there are good um, insights where you don't give, give we, because um, let's say now the UK, you know, then they follow like um, the Americans, then they, you know, then they follow, then convene them, then they, um, you know, follow through, then they make that big up, then the things say, and I saw, you know, the uh, people then go enjoy the food more, then go get more money, all the things they with and they do when it comes to portion size and more money. Now, some other, um, you know, countries than like, for example, Germany, um, then they look at with the approach of um, the, 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 the people then health, you know, so then go reduce and so then they go manage the, the health of the people then in the general population. So um, it's really interesting. So thank you for that suggestion then. Okay, so then the last question where have you want to ask? Now, um, how do we, um, how do I think say, portion sizes and the effects we wait? If, I think if you eat larger portions, you become more accustomed to eating larger portions, thus mm -hmm. it goes on to your weight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, thank you. I don't I don't know your, your name. I'm always saying Brian. Anne's name. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, the, Brian. Oh, Brian, yeah. Yeah, Brian. Thank you, Brian. Yes. Yeah, so the 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 more you eat larger portions that you put on your plate, the more inclined that you are to continue eating those portion sizes, which in 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 all will make sure that well, will it will add up as you go along, and then you continue to to add it on its weight. Um. Thank you, Brian. Yeah, that's good. Um. So yeah. So um. With your don't say that uh, um. When when I do eat big portion automatically when our brain got uh, accustomed to, you know, the amount we when I don't put now on our plate. So when they continue for eat the, you know, beaucoup portion of one particular thing, then I saw it go translate into, you know, for, for when I for put weight on, when I go put weight on. So, um, yes, yeah, standing at na, na, na one um, aspect. Anybody else get something where they want to add? Or... No, okay, so the other thing as well, so if you know they eat the, the right portion, uh, you could get the opposite effect, you know, you, you go uh, lose weight for some time, even, you know, you the lack the vital uh, nutrients, vitamin then and mineral way your body need. So also, you know, your body not go function well enough if you know they eat, eat the right portion then as well. Okay, so now um, I want to do one small activity so we could put into, um, you know, um, consideration and, and and to think say how you know eating way with the eat big portion then even if not small biscuits one extra small biscuits or one extra uh, you know portion of, of rest whatever it be it, 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 it amounts to, to weight gain you go you know it, it could increase your weight so I want to ask you know, this question a normal guest so please on a no you know feel bad if you know they get the right answer now number four Mark gonna understand how the two things then, then they relate so if one of the things say when I go eat one extra biscuit weigh now nah, 100 calories so then they nah, the energy where they get from the food every year um so every year you they eat this one biscuit extra biscuit weigh nah, 100 calories how much weight when I think say when I go gain and then the, you go again you go guess on a pound or kg A stone in weight. A stone, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Anne. So Anne saying that now one stone he thinks they wanna go wanna go um put on. So any anybody else gets suggestion and thinks say now more than one stone or less than one stone now when I go gain? I think it all depends on uh, what you're doing as well, whether you change your routine, whether how much mm -hmm. you would gain or lose. So mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, thank you, Brian. Yeah, so it depends as well on the, maybe even the biscuit, whether you're doing exercise and stuff like that. Yeah, so, you know, it depends on, you know, the, the activity, the way on how they do, but also it, it, even sometimes it depends on, you know, the biscuit way on how they eat. But yes, um, okay, so I'll go reveal the answer since nobody gets um, other suggestion. So the answer now around eight to 11 pounds. So you know, and it not be too um, far away from the answer. So about three to five kg now. And I go put, so if when I eat that one extra biscuit, we're now 100 calories. So you go see and say not so much, but when you know, consistently eat and now that much uh, weight now and I go add on um, just from, you know, that one small big biscuit, we're going eat. So it really um, interesting for, for see. So anybody shot? You shot and you shot? Yeah, every shot. That's good. 
and great and uncle dr bell struck as well thank you yeah so it is it is in, interesting for makuna see how you know defending them they adopt okay so now we'll go um, move on to um weight in that energy balance okay so energy balance is really important way with the talk about um you know weight loss and the weight and and all these things then yeah and also you know the the health um weight you know from the put weight of course we know say it the cause disease so um the energy balance it's really important for understand when we talk about weight. So, weight they can explain Nayana the um, how we they keep and maintain we own weight. So the weight where you currently there, the, the weight we on currently get. So, if we they eat um, the calories, so the calories now the energy where we they get from your food. I know say Boku people that know weight in uh, na calories, but just for the purposes for understand this um, diagram where I get Naya and uh, calories now the the energy where we they get from your food where we they eat. So if the calories so the food where we they eat now the same amount way with the bond so when we the you know sometimes we they do physical activity so we they go exercise or even when we the work out when we the breathe and um, with the bond calories with the bond you know the energy where we don't put inside so if the same amounts the come out the same amount the come inside we go uh, remain balanced so it means say when i go maintain on our weight so then they now you know the, the balance way you know you know the shift it's just the you know constant so Waiting to happen then if we shift the balance the, the opposite way. So if we they eat more calories than with the bonham, then we not say that they cause weight gain because you know the shift, you know, um in favor of um weight loss. You they, you know they maybe sometimes you know they do exercise, sometimes um, you know, you um you they eat big portion, then you know the exercise, you know the move, you, you get job where you you they sit on quite you know frequently, you know the you know burn calories, you know they do anything for you know reduce the energy where you don't put inside. So then they, they cause weight gain. So then they now then they, they cause weight gain. Now if we the shift on the other side, so it don't go to the other side, they balance that way. So it means say with the eat less calories, so less food where we they eat, so the portion size is in the small go um then they become smaller. Then when I burn the calories a lot more, so when I do, you know work out, uh, when I do exercise, when I do some activity, when I do, you know keep moving, when I, when I do, you know continue continue for yaba as they say, then you go see say that the balance it go shift in in favor of um, you know weight loss. So you go begin for see say when I do, um, lose losing our weight. So then they really important for um, able for maintain. Um, good good health if we don't get um you know some uh, communication from a gp then a doctor for say when i don't um overweight or in the class when I, as obese or whatever it may be then now this way now you want to get an other word for and then they call it calorie deficit so if the less calories where you eat for you the burn more calories it could mean say you go na, 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 you know the, the weight now you're going to lose essentially so then the na energy balance now, I don't know if uh, um, anybody get question about this, but if I not get any question, when I, um, uh, for now, I, I go ask when I'm going to ask the, the question then at the end of the session, and I'll go explain more about energy balance if I'm not sure. Okay, so as I don't explain energy balance, now when I go understand say that, you know, for uh, cool uh, times we don't talk now this program say that you know if we uh, know they look after we we um eating habits we know they uh, control what you with the eat then it will cause you know weight gain we go you know uh, um become obese or overweight or whatever that might be so it really important say that you know we therefore look after that aspect because once we don't get that added weight then you could get more successibility for get cardiovascular disease cancer and diabetes now especially in um we community with the eat um, you know high intake of carbohydrates so carbohydrates now um also with the get the energy the most amount of energy now they with the get on because now the, the carbohydrates then they get um then they get changed to um glucose glucose now the sugar where they go now we um, bloodstream so now then they then they give we energy but because we they eat boku um like rice um, yam uh, cassava with the it's big portion then then what thing that happens the with they get that high um rise of um sugar now we blood which means say that then insulin 
way they regulate the blood sugar now we now we blood you know they work because we don't you know over them. so when we don't over them, now so we they get diabetes so it really important mark we understand say that you know the high intake of carbohydrate then so you know we rest we cassava it contributes largely to you know the the um the the, the way we they get diabetes now with community so sometimes when you know then they give you that um diagnosis say you get pre-diabetes that means say um you know you um blood sugar level don't be high to the point where if we're not continuing that road when i go get diabetes so the within then the suggestion are low carb diet so low carb diet it means say when they reduce the amount of them food then they them particular food them like we rest cassada pandodiam gari so that then you know possibly when i go able for reverse arm, possibly when i go able for you know um catch the thing earlier on um before they get worse and then they get diabetes so it also important when i get when i hp a1c um blood test from when i gp now make the mot really important you know every year when i get to my blood test and ask for that so you when i go able for check say you know when our sugar level then at the the right level way they will be so then then I want thing where I suggest for now for do. So Mark, we look then um, at the food and where we get now we own community. Um, so luckily now um, in, in the other um, presentation that where I do, I be get this Nigerian um, hot food hot where I be use as, um, you know, the eat well guide because we know we get we own yet. But now this now um, actually formalized one, um, public health um, nutrition um, formalized eat well guys. So it's similar to the one way you know, they see on a GP then in the practice or in a um, hospital and at the same one, but then you know, change the food them for reflect with it with the eat now we uh, population and at these two um, nutritionists or three nutritionists, sorry, we, um, you know, uh, collide together for, for do this thing for, for the community. So as we can see now, yeah, this now the eat well guide. And as you can see now, now plates now we get now, yeah. So the plates represent the amount where we did for eat for each food group where you get now, yeah. So for example, now the yellow bits, you can see this now the carbohydrates. So you can see now, yeah, we get with cassava, we yam, we um, sweet potato, we get we rest, um, you know, breadfruits, plantain, green banana, all these things, then yeah, where we they eat. Now, only quarter of the plate now, you know, we therefore uh, um, have this food group, this carbohydrates, a normal quarter of the plate now, therefore take the, um, uh, the plates, therefore take, you know, and then the half of the plates, as you can see now, yeah, now we fruits and vegetable, as you can see, then add all the different um, vegetable and fruit where we they eat now we community like okra, things that like so. So it really important that we you know uh, include this food them in every meal where we the get and half of the plates now fruit and vegetable. Now the ratio I know said and they tell you now the UK now uh, eat your five a day now than they say, but sometimes people then they struggle with dandid and they think say how are we able to find you know a five different or um, uh, fruits and vegetable, but the ratio actually now uh, three vegetable and two fruit them. And the two fruit them now so you're able to control um, the sugar because although a natural sugar is still, you know, the impact you, your sugar level in your bloodstream. So really important, Mac, you know, you, you, you eat the right amount of fruits as well. Then as we see now, yeah, we get to be protein. So then there are the uh, meats, so the chicken, the fish, um, all them things they are even uh, you know being them uh, and stuff like that then then now uh, the quarter quarter of the plates as well and then that uh, should be um, the portion that we want to put on our plates and then of course I know say um, uh, Boku of the know they you know um, drink Boku milk or use Boku dairy products but this now the non-animal protein where we need obviously for um, repair our muscle and and also, you know, to, to the amino acids where we get for, you know, good health and stuff like so. Now, now Dan and I, where they get them from. So it really important that we still include some of these um, non-animal um, dairy protein. So then the uh, non um, non um, animal protein, sorry, instead of dairy. Um, so then then now then then now we therefore of course still have now replaced, but not as much as we you know the other thing the way you see. But then as you see now the outside. 
this now the thing then where I don't um you know talk about uh, now this session then so the thing then where with the fry fries so like puff puff um malt drink then condensed milk all these things then yeah now you know then they cause um you know a lot of um issue with the, the blood sugar level so again at the um diabetes talk where um uh, Dr. Aziza can talk he goes show now how you know the impact and then in the next session where I go and uh, talk about diabetes and the food then and how it the impacts we could go more into how the different food group then and they interact um with we um blood sugar levels as well okay so then mark we look then on the uh, you know the recommended portion sizes way um you know the british nutrition foundation done uh come out with and also say but cool people that now we community then they struggle with uh, portion sizes then because then things say um you know the the advice way then gets outside you know apply to them you know they're able to translate them so it go you know easy for them for um for back them follow so um the british nutrition foundation then you know did uh, then then don't um put some of the food them way with they eat on there so namika the share and so with tuna but also some of the food them way with the most commonly eat now with community then they there as well so for example rest with the eat boku rest now with community as we know so the recommended portion size now of course um it will differ when you cook or, or dry it's because when you when the cook and the water it is soak up the water so you go it go way more now no say no not to all mango go by when you scale for go with and then rest or meat or then cereal so now make a um uh, put the the hand measurements so then in a more easy way for um you know quickly and efficiently just you know uh, measure our portion sizes then so if we're not the use um if on a one measure when I cook rest now 100 gram now it should be so um if on a one um measuring with on a hand then if gonna put on a hand then it's like so and they put an over the plates on that if they around the surrounding then they at the right portion size where they forget but for now one measure and way dry now 65 grams but when I go use on a hand then two handful now then the nine now the you know um then be give me one word where um I'll be there for use um but I go I go ask somebody else later on they go remind me waiting at the word for the then portion where they use with a hand but then um for the yam and cassada, cassava, so the um, portion size then for that day. So again, as I don't say, I don't say not all, not all mango go away, am, but now 180 grams and then the boiled version. Now I don't say with the, you know, get pound the yam with the used dairy um, and tinder like so. So I go show now, um, you know, with pictures then what the portion size um this will be for, for yam and cassava way now. You don't pound like pounded yam or gari and so on. But if not the boiled one, now four tablespoons, if now, you know, one use something way more uh, practical, more easy, now four tablespoons now on a different use for now yam and cassava. Now for una meat, um, again, so like una chicken, una fish, una beef, I know say we like for eat we meat now with community. So a really important mark we portion, um, you know, the, the right amount, especially because Nadanda could cause a lot of, um, you know, cardiovascular disease because of the, you know, saturated fat where they can be the, the meat. So a really important mark we monitor the, the amount where we they eat. So for um, the meat, now around 100 to 160 grams for the fish, it would be around 140 to 160. So um, if when I want um, using a hand for measure any chicken or beef, now the size of a whole hand, so the whole hand size, now then the next should be the portion for um, on a chicken and on a beef. But then for um, on a fish, now the um, palm, the size of on a palm, so this round size, now yeah, and then this should be the size for the fish we on a day, uh, put now on a plate. Now, for una cereal, so then they like now na, na the porridge or um, bran flakes or um, you know um, Kellogg's, any of them uh, things that way when they eat um, for breakfast, cook quicker oats or um, you know um, oats in uh, then you know by themselves as well. Then they now around thirty to forty grams. So sometimes and uh, at the na the UK then they get then small packets of um, porridge. 
and you can see say even at the um the amount within the put now the exact amount around 30 to 40 grams not in the put now the packet than then at the recommended portion size for any cereal where on they eat in the morning so again if for now one for so use simpler method now two uh, two handfuls now that they use for um on a cereal in the, in the morning as well so then there as i don't show now, now the most common food way with the eat um you know as, as human being but also most most importantly in our community so really important map we the um you know um monitor those ones specifically because then denying because um you know um high rates of diabetes because with the eat boku rest with the eat boku and the down with the eat boku curry so we really need for um control this one then as well okay so now Mark, we move on to um, the method then way we were able for use for um, control our portion then. So as I've been done say, you know, we were able for use, uh, um, use we and then and stuff like, like, like that. But there's, then we get other methods then we want to go able for use for, um, you know, control on a portion size. So one of the one uh, way I uh, recommend, which is an easy method for use, now to use smaller plates then and, and cutlery. So smaller plates, because um, psychologically, when we the, um, put food now we plate, as I don't say, we be guys. So we, I could look, say, ah, I don't angry today. I not eat the whole day. So, you know, I go flop me plates because, you know, I'm angry, but, you know, it, it's it quite easy for do, but then if we have for uh, change that plate and I put on a small bowl, you can see say that you know the the um the bowl small, so the food could look more filling, even though uh, you know when I not add boku food na the na the bowl, but when I mind for things say ah the the, the uh, bowl don't flop, so you know I go satisfied with the food where I don't put inside the bowl, but when you know, they put on a large plate, you go immediately think say are they for flop the plate for maki. Uh, you know, um, satisfy me. So really important. Mac when I use smaller plates, so when I go able for um, put the right amount there. And then when I, they say cutlery, people then they laugh me. Then they say, "What do you mean cut, small cutlery? I, I go use small cutlery, small spoon, small uh, fork." But the the science behind that, uh, um, for say again psychologically, we go able for eat slower. You know, we go able for eat slow. We're not going to rush through with food. So it's a thick time. And again, then they go help with digestion as well. We go help for Mac, we feel um, very full. So as Uncle John don't say, um, you know, you sometimes, you know, if you even finished all the, the food where you left, and the, where you put on your plate, you know, therefore, you know, uh, force yourself, you go left and for later on, you go eat and whatever. Um, but if when they use that smaller fork or smaller spoon, you'll be able to take time when when they eat. So you could become more mindful for, you know, to say, okay, I don't, I don't bear full. I know they will carry on. I don't reach my limits. Now, the other one way um, when I go able for use now, just the plates on our own plates. So the way the method, how it go, how they work now, um, the way on the put the food then the different food group then way on a different put on the plate. So as I don't say, these are not the major um, food group then way on a different include in every meal way on a they eat because again the carbohydrates now they on a they get on our energy and a protein again then they go make on a feel um, you know very full on a they go to feel um, uh, could get satiety, then they mean you go feel, you know, full, very full, you know, go feel angry straight after when I don't eat when I meal. And then fruits and vegetables, again, then they, again, I could talk about the fruits, but vegetables, so, you know, like we cassada leaf, we crane crane, all that thing, then they, then they go class as the veg. So then they get high fiber. So that means say it go um, break, break down um, slowly. It go release that um, sugar um, sugar in, a, um, in in the in, in, a, in the the blood slowly. So that means say when I, again when I go feel very full until when I therefore eat on our next meal. So you know you not go angry as soon as when I don't finish on our food. So when are they say fruits? So say for example if when I they get um, you know porridge when I they eat in the morning, the carbohydrates now now the porridge itself now go go under the carbohydrates hydrates and then um the protein will be the milk and then um the fruits could be you know the, the the half of the, the bowl could be the fruit. So now quarter of the carbohydrates, so then then you rest, you come the yam, gari, and um, a quarter of your protein, then then you meat, so like your chicken, your beef, your fish, and then half of the plate should be, um, you know, your vegetable then. And again, if now breakfast now with the talk box, then, you know, half of the bowl, now fruits now and the puts there as well. 
The other method as well, we're on agreeable for use, which is an old fashioned method, um, na, uh, you know, simple food diary. So, where the rights would have food, where they eat, because Mr. Seth are not going able for Taluna with their eats um, last week, Monday, are not going able for Taluna. So, it's really good for keep this, um, you know, um, food diary. So, when they become even more mindful for waiting, I don't eat, um, waiting, uh, 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 eating habits. So, waiting, they eat most frequently. What's that for change? Um, sometimes you go, Able for see say oh I did eat boku rice maybe I did for change and maka you know change that around or sometimes when I go see say when I know they eat boku vegetable or sometimes when I go see say when I did eat boku protein or when I did eat something maybe when I know they eat uh, enough um, food them we get variety so it really important makuna um, maybe explore what you know they actually eat so when I go able for no um, uh, when I did for make changes them as well so written food diary good for that that reason okay. And then the other one, as I don't say, now um, for using a hand, then then in a really um, easy way for for doing. So as you see, as you know, they see, um, handful, cup hand, and um, face. This now now all team the way on are able for use. Now the face more now for your protein, so your fish, your meat, and thing like so. You cup hand now more for you, um, rest or your pasta or whatever way on they eat. Um, and also saying that the Western world with they eat other food than apart from you know we. The African food then so you know um you go use that that measure there and handful again for your cereal then stuff like so so um the problem with the hand then you know you know sometimes you're not going to be that as accurate but one thing I, I go tell you now um as you see me so I get my own hand my own size and my own size for my own hand uh, you know somebody else could get another size um hand so the portion way when I get not the one for USSF not for um somebody else now your own portion because the it the, um coincide with you your hand okay so your hand so the bigger you are the the bigger the portion will be the smaller you are now, the smaller the portion will be because the current relate with your hand then but if when I want to be more precise so for example if I when I get um you know operation way uh, it require you for my lose weight then you might um the the advice where they give you and I said I want to be more precise then you know when I buy weighing scales for Makuna measure the food then so you go able to know the exact amount where you don't um uh, cook or you don't put it on your plate as well now the other um good um Thing where you go able for use now this book yeah where then called carbs and cows so carbs and cows as you may see see and so um at the bottom i know say the, the um, writing small but um it's supported by diabetes uk because um it gets really it then gets really good um advice on the amount of um um, sugar, blood sugar levels, way they affect the food, how they affect the blood sugar level, they give you the, the number, they also give you the calories where they are the food, and then they also show you the picture of the portion size of the food way they for eat. Now, this, as they say, now world food, so we get with food then they, it, it gets all, you know, the plantain, gari, pandagam, all these things then, yeah, occurred, it, it then at the book, so, you know, you go able to see the picture, waiting the portion size, um, they for be. So you go see the picture of the plates, how the, the, the person don't put the food, and then you go able for match onto your own. So then in an easy way, simple way for users. So the last time where uh, we check, now Amazon, it costs around 15 pounds. Um, now from the Diabetes UK website, you go find and day for around 10 pounds, 11 pounds. So around 11 to 15 pounds, but then in a good um, resource if you're not able for, for getting an interest in, in, in you know, um, something like so. Then the other one way when I go able for use, which now if you're a tech savvy person, so you're not good with technology, then you're not go able for download then um, food tracking apps. So one way I they recommend now my fitness pal, and I'll say one of the things then with this one is um, that on a different be quite precise they ask you um the weight of the food so then there's some time it could be a bit um time consuming for some people then you know go get them um, for for do down there but it, it got some people then they don't put the weight for you so you know you know therefore you know um where i'm at yourself you just find, find waiting somebody else don't put not the not the app and you add them to your own um thing but um also the other uh, disadvantage now, um, not so all the we food them way with the eat you go able for fan now na, na this app so you go struggle a bit for macro see the calories or macro see the the amounts there so you know you go struggle a bit because you're not go able for fan all the food them way with the eat so then then are some of the consideration way and I therefore think but 
all these methods, you know, you go able to find which one, um, you know, suits you, which one they fit you most. Now, that is the most important thing um, about it. Okay, so um, the other thing where I want for Shona, now how the, um, how are they able to use on a plate then for portion the, the right um, food then? Now, um, as, as always, I know say um, it's quite difficult for Shona salon food then because um, we don't get Boku people then where they do so. Sometimes maybe na, na, na me call for do some something like so, so I go able for be uh, more direct with the, the um, advice, but uh, even so, you know, the food and way uh, Nigerian then or West African way, the way they eat now be similar, very similar. So it, it not changed that much. So I was in the able for see, I, I take this from this um, uh, Instagram page where they call um, Lose It Nigerian. So then they help people then for lose weight by um, within they eat their own food. So they're not there for, you know, um, square balance, say then they just eat Western food then um, just because they want for lose weight. You go able for lose weight, even with we own food. But a normal portion control now go, you know, help on her for, for losing weight and, and eat healthier. So as you see, Naya, um, for example, you know, then put the right amount of plantain on the side and the vegetable and I see the meat where them put on the plate, a, a well portioned. Or let's say you know, we want to eat okra with gari or pounded yam or so, you see the bowl where they use and you see the, the amount of meat where they put quarter quarter of the um, pounded yam and gari, you see how the, the amount is there. Um, so really good for see how, you know, you're not able to portion out even soup then, so plus us and, and, and so on. So for example, say if you want to eat jollof rice, you know, the plate, not so the full plate, therefore flop day with rest. When I go able for, um, you know, use half of the plates with, you know, salad, we'll go fill on that. And then quarter of a plate with the uh, chicken, the meat or the fish or whatever, and then quarter of a plate of the rest as well. Same with the fish naya and the plantain and the sauce. Um, even I have the stew. So say if and I want breakfast where, you know, like the African breakfast where the guess where you want put uh, maybe yam and plantain and maybe um, some egg um, with sardine when they put it on the side. You can see, say, a well portion out the way they put on, you know. Um, and then the last um, picture, yeah, you go see for one day. So for example, if I want to eat when I breakfast, when I get omelette, where when I make, when I they mix them with beaucoup vegetable, then, then they go fill up, you know, the... Um, half a plate and then two slices of bread as I see there. And then also the plasas, if I put the rest in um, the bowl, quarter of the, the um, bowl be in uh, the, uh, the uh, rest, they will be there. And then the half of them, you see as the vegetable where, where you don't see nayana, your cassada leaf, your okra, spinach, whatever it may be. And then they put the small meat, quarter of the, the small meat, it's not the, not the uh, both stuff. So when I'm able for see, say, you go able for portion control with the food and way with the eat quite easily. If when I want for use use on a plate, that ending at the most easy math method. But if when I um you know one more precise thing than than the other method we are done tell on um go help on for be more precise with um the, the amount of food we want to eat as well. Okay, so then lastly I go um share the tip then for how and I go able for control portion sizes outside of the method then where I don't give on that as well. So um, one of the tips then where I do give now for um, able for drink a glass of water 30 minutes before and they eat on a meal. The reason why I they say so, because if you uh, drink that water day, you be like a flop. So when on a day eat, um, when I not go, you know, feel that angry. So when I go able for manage the portion where when I don't portion out for, for myself. Then the other tip where they give now for eat slow, you no, know? okay. So now therefore try for chew properly, you know, um, take an attempt for for chew the food because also it will help your body for for digest the food. You you body not therefore do all the hard work because you don't you know break down the food properly. And again, it help una for become more mindful. Actually, it help una for enjoy una food. But the most important thing, mak una not be distracted as well. Some people then then they watch the um, television when then they eat or sometimes in the then then at them phone or then they read book or whatever. Now not they pay mind to the food and then they go cause for una for eat quite quickly. But for now not distracted and agreeable for eat slow as well. 
The other thing where the, um, you know, not, you know, not go able to control on a portion size, if now they eat straight from the packet. So say, for example, now uh, crisp or, and um, mostly now, now, now the crisp then or the snack, then we're not so healthy. Now with the, you know, just pick straight from the packet to continue for eating. We're not going to able for know how much you know, they eat. You know, they just go through them and it, it go more hard for stop. So if I don't measure out the portion, then you know, and I'm not go overeat that that particular thing. Even that container, if the food then a container, if I portion out the food already, and I'm not go you know um, be tempted for eat the 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 whole thing um, and and eat and fast as well because when I don't portion out the food na na the plate. The other thing now for so check when I food label them. So um, particularly na ya um, and even even in Africa then we get you know um, the food label where they tell you how much serving, um, the, the, the serving size, what it is for be. So all manufacturers go get them serving size within the recommend. They go say this um, package, they, they serve two people them or one person. But some 10 people, they know they watch the um, labels. They don't know say that not for one person, not for two people then. You go able for split and. But if I not read that, I not going to know say nah, for you know two person, three people then, four people then, I not go able for shape and the right way. So, you know, when I read on our labels, then see how much they say because each manufacturer it go differ so product from product it will get different serving size way than don't put by the the uh, label now and um, the other thing where um uh, um boku people that no no and then the thing say snacking a bad thing um, of course, um, the snack them way uh, people then they say, oh, you know, avoid for snack in between meal now because um, now unhealthy snack them now with you know with the eat before with with the eat with meals so then they go you know well we 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 appetite so like crisp them biscuits uh, chocolates all them things then they they know they serve no purpose for um, you know snacking because also when when I don't eat and again it go um, shoot up your blood sugar level. Um, but then it go drop back and it go feel angry, more angry. So then when it get the, the time reach for for eat on a main meal, when I go angry, so na no not go able for satisfy with the food when I don't put on na the plate when you don't portion, you go say ah I angry, I can put more on my plate because I'm angry. So what here they recommend now for eat um food them way high in protein, high in fiber. And um, for for a snack then, so for example, unsalted nuts, so not then we not get salt added to uh, to them, and um, boil boil egg or or fruit, thin then like so, then they go help on a fulfilled food, where uh, until you know na, the the time reach for makuna eat on a lunch or on a dinner or a main meal and so on. So you know try for um you know include this thing then yeah so na no go feel that hungry then the portion. Um, way on a the, the change because I know say when on a the reduce on a portion size because people struggle because you could think say ah I, 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 I don't use to the portion where I don't I be done putting on my plate for you know the past years five years six years however long so it really important mark on a try to adjust so this not the the best method way on a go able for use to adjust to the smaller portion sizes than way uh, when I put on a plate so then as I said on a plan you know um, healthy snacks um, for for example, for now they uh, get uh, um, when I, say you get your working day when they wake up, let's say nine o'clock. You know, about ten o'clock, eleven o'clock before when I lunch, way maybe twelve or one o'clock, whatever the time. If now they plan that healthy snack day, um, mid morning before when, when I lunch, then when the lunch time, when I not go feel that angry, and then even before when I evening meal mid-afternoon so around then four five or three four depending on the time we when on the eat on our um, main meals let's say eight o'clock when they eat on our main meal then again when i go not go feel that angry way when they reach to the point where uh, when they eat on our evening meal then so you know try to incorporate these snack then now on our meals so um yes then then at the last slide for for today so and i uh, give a thank you for where when i joined the session now they can um, open up the floor for um, any question and uh, question that we're gonna get, and uh, also if um, when I need any personalized um, nutrition meal plan or any um, uh, help or advice for weight loss or anything like so, where when I need then when I get um, you know um, the the. Um, well, but the better past entry uh, email where um, Uncle John don't share with you now. 
at the beginning of the session. Um, but also we get the Slogum Health, um, none of them, they still use that um, uh, email address that Uncle John could tell me um, if not, not, then they still use that. But also my own um, you know, email address, newbornnutrition94gmail.com. Um, I go try for help when I, um, as best as I can. So if I want, um, you know, get in touch, then feel free to get in touch. Um, but yes, now, now standing, this NAMI references. Okay, thank you all. Okay, we'll stop sharing the, the presentation. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ati Fatima. The family, on the other hand, Ati Fatima don't talk to we almost for an hour. He didn't explain to we, you know, um, we said it in a way before they do. But make sure see we eat healthy. Now, the world don't left to win out as to how we will go and use this information wisely. Um, obviously, he mentioned something about um, the size, everybody different. So, they are um, not say because um, somebody else, you know, and big pass you, you know, you decide to say, well, you, you add another bonia. Um, that would <laughs> That would not in any way like add the weight. Um, they don't explain to me a lot about the different foods that we get. As I've been saying at the beginning, <clears throat> a lot of the things that we eat, then good, not to see them bad. Um, now the way how we eat them, now then they will get that habit in order for change as to how we consume the food, and also we lifestyle as to when we don't eat the food, how we live with life after. Because on 10 days, some of we are not like more than I don't get it after that day. I don't can't see the a lie, say, I don't really do well. I'm telling you, eat, which you don't, straight to bed. You go sleep. The food don't get no chance for like, a digestion. They wake up in the morning. I don't know if anybody does it happen to her. If they wake up very early, maybe in the middle of the night, they feel like the food still in their chest. It's because you know, don't, you know, you know, don't digest. And so today as well, <clears throat> where we cannot eat them. Because we don't allow the food for their digest, the belly still they feel like say angry because the food they up here and all go down Musa if I go. They will feel for you know for eating again. Instead of going to drink water, maybe drink one water for try for you know they go we'll cut more. Hey, me, I, me, I, me, I, me, I, me, I don't do it. Me, I don't want to people away. Is it that if it happen, I want to find out my own way or I can like do experiment. So okay, they say that's where they are policy by if I say they are put me. No, me, 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 your system is different. Oh yeah, nobody's system, <laughs> not different. If we continue for the life, now we say, 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 they do. Um, so thank you very much. So any questions for me? Um, uh, I'll change the setting I allow now for you. Um, there you go. Auntie... Yes, Auntie, Auntie Victoria. Sorry. Thank you very much. Hello, Auntie. Okay, thank you. Thank me, you, thank you. Me question I want to ask you, you know you talk about this question. Mm -hmm. Some of us, as John don't say, we go eat one, especially with young food, if they plus us. Mm -hmm. Nice. You will go maybe for seconds or thoughts. It matters if not to every day they do. Like for say in a week, I try this thing where they say like a Monday, no meat Monday, mm -hmm. you just healthy on a Monday. Mm -hmm. Yes, thank, thank you, um, Auntie Victoria, where you raised that, because um, I actually forget for um, say down the, not so immediately, as you see with the biscuits example, where I give, now um, over a, you know, a, a consistent period where they do the same pattern, where they flop the place, flop the place, flop the place, and then they go continue for max, you know, you put weight, but let's say you want one day, you then a party, you go eat different places, it, you know, you, you go flop your plates because na party you want to enjoy. Then they're not gonna make you, you know, gain gain the weight. But if not consistently, now they do then they now then they go make um you know ultimately you go you know um put the weight on. And also, if it depends also on how active you, you be. So if you uh, they exercise more, um you know you 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 you're very active. You you um the amount where you therefore put now your plates go increase because you you don't you know um ex, ex, exceed the energy already so you therefore put them back in in order for you to you know um get that that right energy balance again we are done say the i hope i, I explain them properly but yeah mm -hmm. it, it really depends on how active you are as well okay thank you i think what we be forget we not be we not be member they call them mm -hmm. mondo 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 
Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank. Thank you. Thank you. I'm not. Be, I don't be remember. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Uncle John. Yeah. Um. As I was about to yeah, Brian and Anna, are they, I'll come to you guys in a bit. As I was about to be say, everything we you do in life, we get for do it moderately. Um. A, a quick example of Mrs. F. I don't day for a while now. I don't play football for. I mean, for a long time. I'm talking about three, four, five years. I don't play. I decided a couple of weeks ago I go play. I mean, know which I feel. God help, or um, Doctor Tui exercise been there for for the back. Uh. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't been talking, but even the last session will do me back. Me they kill me. I've been mm-hmm. getting pillow, you know, cushioning at the chair while mm-hmm. This is is a result of one and all the exercise regularly. Mm-hmm. I saw I've been yeah. exercise before. Two, mm-hmm. the way I sit down before, sit down all day with me on type of job. Mm-hmm. Right? Yes, I can mm-hmm. walk around a little bit. Easy for let we forget for sit down three, four, five hours. Easy. Mm-hmm. Depends yes. on it. Then the other bit is when you come out of that kind of lifestyle, mm-hmm. long of them say, you know, if you're not to spring chickens anymore, you know, so long do things moderately. You know, take a bit mm-hmm. by step by step. You'll get back, maybe you might get back to the level you've been there. But mm-hmm. easy. If somebody younger, they do something more than you, you can let go. Remember, so you said that at one point. But well, you're not there again, so take your time and get back into routine. Yes, boy. Right. Hello, Fatima. Hi, Anne. Thank you for that presentation. It was lovely. Yeah. Uh, thank very you. Thank you very, very much. Informative. I'm yeah. diabetic. Okay. Yeah. I'm controlled. Okay. Yeah. But like where the weight is, the only problem I have is because I'm asthmatic. One of my right. Right. Got steroids in. Okay, okay. So um have you heard of um a company called Buzz Manchester? No. Because they um do uh, kind of like um physical activity referrals for people that have got um like diabetes and stuff like that. So they do exercise that's specific to people that have got diabetes. So I'd really recommend them um, get in touch with them, maybe get your GP to maybe do the referral because I think it's either you can self, self like refer yourself or you get your GP to, to refer yeah. you to um, Bos Manchester. Um, but they do like personalise to people that have got, you know, different conditions. But diabetes is definitely one. And they can do a plan for you and help you through the exercise. And then for, for all men, um, if a man need, you know, that kind of uh, assistance, um, Bos Manchester is a good um, organisation for that. Andy. But yeah, and, um, I would really recommend them um, yeah. for that. Um, yeah, because also yeah. with your asthma. Yeah. Yeah. I check every 12 months for my diabetes and I've just had yeah. one and yeah. so altered from 12 months ago. Mm-hmm. You know, it, my blood oh, and was quite good. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's great. So definitely um, portion control and um, all of that is definitely going to help with um, obviously your diabetes. And I don't want to give too much because the next session um, that um, Dr. Ziza is going to do. She's going to talk about diabetes, but then I'll bring it in with the uh, nutrition topic as well. So, you know, I'm going to give quite some good advice there as well. So um, do try to attend to that one as well. Yeah. But yeah. Thank oh, you. thank you, Fatima. I mean, I'm, You're welcome, I'm, man. You're welcome. portions are going to be smaller than mine, aren't they? Because the difference in sizes, like you say. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Yeah, 100%. Good, good blood sugar level, you know, keep up oh that's for the doctors that's for the doctors what's the good because i know pre-diabetes is, a, is it around is it 47 uncle doc is that an indication of pre-diabetes or pre-diabetes is uh, uh 47 yeah okay yeah yeah, 42 to 47. But I'm not too sure about depends, when you're diabetic. It, it depends on whether you're symptomatic or not. 48 onwards is diabetic, depend on whether you're symptomatic or not, uh, based on the WHO uh, uh, diagnostic okay. criteria. Okay, that's Thank great. Thank you, Dr. Trey. That's great. Thank okay. you. Thank you, Uncle Doc. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, like how Brian put it more, let we understand about sizes as well. But like what and don't see. It's not just about size of the individual. It's also dependent on medical conditions and stuff like that. So always do waiting 
convenient one for you but two if you're in doubt speak to a medical professional and i made a day like the people are really back home you go say ah you you go talk down because society you know things better for you but the cow they show in him go well body better pass gently i remember a couple weeks ago because he bumped again he chased me up for money okay now that they were all well and good i've even come to uncle doc with an issue but when he come for the picking in business the actual picking we don't burn now Instead of he chased me as well for money for can go hospital, they tell me say they can't go down to our mommy and they go up mm -hmm. so they get aid. Mm -hmm. Now, now let's think about it. For the picking in Punado, he chased me for money. For the picking in health, he not chased me for money. Just tell me no more out of conversation where we'll be the get where I ask when they do picking health. I then tell you, so for example, for me, I don't tell for the look at we own lifestyle as well when it comes to some of the things in there. But like I have to say about medical condition. Everybody in medical condition different. I know people and we don't change their lifestyle based on exercise. Why do you talk about exercise? Not about going to the gym or maybe running in the park or whatever. Sometimes just need to changes. Things that yeah. life go before you guys say, you know what, I'll take a stroll up the road. Mm -hmm. yes. That's true. I boss, you know, I don't want to name somebody, but who say maybe they go walk before? Wait till they come off two bus stops before the place, for example. Mm -hmm. the work I'm gonna walk. And for some reason, what I will say is it, it, it's so small, which they do, but it gets a massive impact on their health because since they do that, they, everything else don't come under control. And also they look at the type of food the way they eat, you know. Yeah, then see, you know, they do um, one thing, go no more. You see, I don't see, but people they don't decide say that they go on to a diet. I can see that I smile on me. I say, okay, we'll see how long this one lasts. Because, <laughs> because they do one, um, they want, they don't go on social media, they don't see things, they want to do everything so quick. No. Look, the, Kirk is saying, or the Kirk, what will be the same back home? Cut you cut according to your size. Look at your situation. The cow and the Fatima be the same. Have a diary where they keep. So you know how well you do. Begin cut things down gradually, bit by bit, bit by bit. If it takes you six months for let get there, as long as it's working, it's consistent. You're committed to it. For me, I believe say go work. But thank yeah. you very much. Anybody else want to add anything? Yes, yeah, well, I'm question, yeah. Okay. Yes. Fatima, you know, maybe now for the one day we we an expert cook there. Now, yeah, you know, in a salon, we, oh, well, in most African society, when we they cook, like they leave them, better to leave, cassava leaf. Mm -hmm. We they cook uh, so much so that uh, now almost the cow scent, now you they get for now. Uh, mm -hmm. nine people in the you know, then they eat and they boil and so much, uh, all their leaves there and the meat or whatever it is. And um, where be they work on uh, all are during so the children's hospital as well, mostly getting malnutrition picking there. Yeah, then they advise the this thing Pemau. And in the Pemau, you get uh, per mile, small, very minimal amount, maybe one or two spoon per mile. Then you put potato leaf, you need to boil them that much, mm -hmm. and then fish, and then okay, small rest, you know, mixture of all and thing in the. Mm -hmm. Honestly, when in Gideon picking and eating a day, within two, three weeks, mm -hmm. that same picky way malnourish. Mm -hmm. We can see an eye, but they all don't drink. You don't, you know, because we can use things like skin tug or whatever for this, mm -hmm. determine the level of malnutrition. Mm -hmm. But the same picking and the way we don't go home and everything, mm -hmm. they don't get, then feed them with the people, they wouldn't can and they go back to square one almost mm -hmm. to wait in the middle. But mm -hmm. the people and they say, then they cook, then they cook well and mm -hmm. wait till they call. So mm -hmm. what really wait till we they miss in the end mm -hmm. I don't know, is it the way we they cook the food too much that we, mm -hmm. we make the crow, the crow smell or whatever, or, or whatever. Mm -hmm. oh, then we start cooking and let them tell we. I know, you know, maybe then we explain to we better waiting yeah. behind that. Yeah, so thank you. Um, thank you, uh, Uncle uh, Dr. Ture. Um, that, that's a really good point where, where you raised there because um, even at the you know past uh, sessions where I do I, I be you know don't say that um Bukova food then then the class then as superfood functional food then which means they um then gets higher than the um amount of the you know most common food then we the gets naya um then the vitamin and mineral content is higher so when we the, then cook and for long term, it denature, denature then then vitamin then mineral then which means say uh, it means say then the you know they the mineral they the vitamin so no they get that value anymore. 
So when they're doing that, as you can see from waiting, um, uh, Uncle Dr. Ture don't say, then, you know, they cause deficiency because when I know they get the, the benefit from that food there because you, they don't kill the vitamin and they don't kill the mineral. So it really importes a mark we try for just, you know, um, it don't, the, 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 the Points where they always stick, and maybe in a certain time because of the food safety um, issue, then we um, we get so the food hygiene, you know. So when I want to make sure that they kill any jam with it for the food, so I'm dynamic then they cook them for that long. But you know, in hindsight, if when I don't look after that food safety, so if I make sure that they wash the the um, platas or the meat or whatever um, with you know water, we not contaminate or um, we don't you know maybe then, then pull the, the plasas from some side way, um, animal then they will feces them, then go there. So then the bacteria, they go on the, uh, you know, the, the uh, plasas because now the animal, the animal protein, then they go get some sort of bacteria because the animal will come off from, but not the plants. So, you know, once when I don't take that into consideration and I don't control that day, when I know they for cook the plasas for too long because then they go kill the vitamins. So they not, they know, they, they not get um, clear meaning as to why um, people then do so. So now make a one, if you want to ask the general, um, you know, um, you know, the public now, yeah. Um, sometimes they get idea why people then, then they cook the food for a long periods of time. Um, sometimes not, not preference or whatever, but I, I be one get some understanding as to why this, you know, that they happen now, now with country. Anybody they will help we? After you, Madam Mambo. After you, ma'am. No, I think say sometimes why would they cook so much? And what we don't miss with parents that they do. If you don't wash until mm -hmm. death, you know, you know, cook until death. You know, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. you get for really wash up about, you wash about 10 times. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you go boil and say it die. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Auntie Victoria. And then okay. an interesting point. First of all, let us say um hello as a kusher to all man. Kusher. I mean Nanawa is showing me face. Minakai Kimono. Um <clears throat> Fatima, I tell you Boku Boku thank you for this um presentation. Well, because you hope we yai. So Boku team them. Uh, uh, Mr. Gelp me on one or two question them. But first of mm -hmm. all, um, amongst other things, I want to commend you mm -hmm. for what you even try to present to me pictorially oh. within portioning for look like. You know, oh, already um, I mean, we can always get we suspicions, we expectations, and so on. And I'm glad you where you mentioned. Tinder like Bonya and eventually me man say let you not forget about the Mondo you won't say. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These are all things that play a role in mm -hmm. how we um, feed ourselves nutrition. Now mm -hmm. let's just take this opportunity for go back a bit. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, women have been small bobo as a teenager i'm riding on to my 50s now uh i remember say we've been working at plantation mm -hmm. so on day them in the morning for breakfast no, not to be uh toast we've been the eat to mm -hmm. uh, this we've been the eat say one o'clock where you get break you they eat back mm -hmm. yeah, right so i think um in as much as we look at these things one thing we shouldn't forget is what is your mm -hmm. requirement yes. mm -hmm. on calories for the day or within a period of time. Mm -hmm. It's very interesting because um, after I came to Europe and started living here, I live in Germany, um, very often I had what I'd call an unbalanced diet, mm -hmm. meaning I often went without breakfast mm -hmm. and had a main meal late in the afternoon or early evening. Mm -hmm. And like, um, uh, my brother been mentioned, Sunday can they, you can eat so late, you they grab middle nets on a morning and you feel safe, mm -hmm. but you eat, this you don't yeah. have, you know, yeah. digest. Mm -hmm. And I recognized, mm -hmm. whoa, my activities had changed. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. even, I used to be a little sportier mm -hmm. and now 
I was a lot less sportier, mm -hmm. all right? Um, yeah. There are just two things I'd like to ask, but um, I suspect those would be directed more correctly towards our medical participants mm. here. One is um, the rate of metabolism of a person. How does it affect how we eat? Because I, I know there are times you're, you're probably eating in a group and you see someone who looks slim and all of that, and you're the one that says, ah, but it's possible to eat What do you do with it? How are they able to maintain yeah. in weight? Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. And yeah. Um, I'm not sure. Probably that has got to do with the rate of metabolism. Yes. yes. We all go through in different ways, mm -hmm, which is mm -hmm. also affected by our activities. Yes. You know? 100%. Um, also, um, just, I know, I know I'm to take the thing for long. I will just try highlight two points quickly. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, one would be sort of like trying to cartographize, I mean, get in pictures and calories and uh, pictograms, how our local foods could be optimally consumed. Like Naramek, I've been glad we should have picture there with plantain, Mm -hmm. Petete and so on, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. because uh, sometimes you know when we become a lot more conscious of it. I mean, apart from just the home environment where we eat, waiting come, exactly. right? Um, you start asking yourself, well, how much calorie day is like cassada leaf or jollof mm -hmm. rice? Yeah, and it, yeah. if person go put jollof rice for you, then put kekte kekte uh, uh, portion then small small <laughs> beef but you they look at plates they you you ask the court oh man no no me can go na kitchen go take the pot go but them right that's one that's of true. them uh, mm -hmm. right um it also has to do with our probably growing up philosophy and psychology of it mm -hmm. right um 100%. now i Excuse me, I just lost the thread on what the second point I wanted. Ah, yeah. Um, coming to foods like I heard Pila be mentioned, and uh, I'm not sure if people are aware of uh, Pemahuin, Pemahuin and Pila. You know, these are like native, more um, natively consumed meals. You'd find them in what we Saloman can call upline. Um, yeah. For instance, Pemawi, they can call it the traveler's meal. I love it's Pemawi. Like, <laughs> yeah, favorite. you know, so Pemawi <laughs> and Baguda, you know, chopped yeah. cassava and beans and all of these mm -hmm. kinds of mm -hmm. food. You mm -hmm. know, um, sometimes if, for, for instance, Naya, the last time I tried to cook granite soup, I had to go mm -hmm. buy peanut butter and ask friends of mine, how are we able to do this properly, you know, so that mm. it would taste like granite soup the mm -hmm. way I'd, um, I'd like it, you know. I mean, these are some of the aspects mm -hmm. I'd like, oh, I appreciate about your presentation. These are the okay, questions I've had in my mind for a long time. Thank but you. also, I think we, we should take into consideration um, what the rate of metabolism mm -hmm. of a person is. Yeah. Um, the regular tests, especially with blood sugars and so on, mm -hmm. and how this can be affected with age over time. Mm -hmm. And um, probably we should start thinking as Sierra Union to produce either literature in the form of books, written texts, mm -hmm. YouTube mm -hmm. videos, whatever media we mm -hmm. have available on how we can actually start optimizing our own feeding. Yes. Um, yeah, just the final point, why we cook our food so long. I'm not sure if everyone here agrees with me or probably is even aware of what I'm about to say. I was born in the early 70s. And I remember shortly, well, when I was a child, I mean, I'm a small bubble, Nigeria, in the area. There was an outbreak of cholera in Sierra Leone over lettuce leaves because mm. part of the manure system was mm -hmm. using actual um, excuse, yes. but I'll have to put it this way, mm -hmm. was used 
uh, was using feces to manure yeah. the yeah. stuff, right? Yeah. And this didn't get broken down in time. Mm -hmm. uh, in mm -hmm. fact, I think afterwards it was forbidden by mm -hmm. law in Sierra Leone to manure mm -hmm. the garden or grounds using mm -hmm. these methods. Mm -hmm. you know? I see. And I suspect I see. food safety is part of the reason why we, we probably intuitively up to today cook the foods mm -hmm. still the vitamins and all other trace mm -hmm. nutrients are gone right yeah thank you thank you thank you very yeah. much all right then um, uncle you, um, I'll, I'll, Kimono. excuse me i'm going to put my um video off again or i'll no wait problems. until you <laughs> but yeah but thank those you are much. my contributions and my hearty thanks to you no, thank, thank you, um, Uncle Kimono. Thank you very much. Um, really uh, the last point, point we're making, and uh, I too have one uh, we be asked. It may be that's the reason, but I will refer to one of the professionals and let one answer. And um, we bring four points in. Um, the first one are the rate of metabolism, and I will pass on to mm -hmm. the doctor they have part on that. Mm -hmm. The second one, it will be more to you, and to Fatima, we in uh, something for do with African food calorie count, basically. You know, if we don't get them already, maybe in a certain way, yeah, you know, what is them? Yeah, you chose them to come along, you know, and I look at more of the foods them. I know you should have plates before, but maybe mm -hmm. more food that will come later on. Uh, mm -hmm. and the benefit of it, but then they will tie up with why we cook food them so long. Um, mm -hmm. I believe, see, we all get to easy, but I think that's another reason because I remember. Um, I know as old as um, Mr. Kimono, but even when we say they grow up as alone, um, we constantly they get cholera outbreak. And, you know, like a practice we refer to say we can use for manure. They can use the animal one and they can use the motorman one them as well. Now, as mm. to how long that did it take as well for breakdown, I think by the time we and they plant the food to the time where that thing they will break down and become normal stuff, a knocking, you know, the... the the bacteria that we can dip and I'm knocking on break down enough, you know, that when yeah. they, they go pull the plants now, one, and they're knocking worse and fine, but two, they go fine low, and I tell you as well as to how long, if something like that they exist in our food, how long somebody, be, you know, if, even if the person don't know about it, but if it exists in our food, how long would they go cook the food for? We they're not going for worry, but then kind of thing, and they, that they go be a, okay. so I will go for some metabolism, then we'll come so, to um, to be honest, um, um, Uncle John, I can answer a bit of the me, me metabolism and oh, that yeah. while with the ad and then um, the, the doctors can chip in um, more from a maybe medical scientific. Um, so, but weight in weight loss management, yes, there's um, what is called an um, estimated energy requirement for each individual person. So that will be uh, calculated from your age, your gender. Um, you know, the, your physical activity levels and, and, and so on. So that's what, you know, is taken into consideration under that EER. Um, if you wanted to go through more complex kind of equations to calculate your um, kind of metabolism, there's also um, equations to do that. And that then will then create what is called, um, you know, doing that calculation will then um, create a calorie deficit for that person to lose weight or whether they want to, you know, maybe gain weight. Some people want to gain weight for whatever reason. Maybe they've had um, rapid weight loss because of a disease or whatever. So they want to gain weight. So there's those equations there um, that nutritionists can do, dietitians can do to help you um, lose weight. So I can do that for people myself um, um, to kind of lose weight personalized in a personalized way so you'll get that calorie amount that then you you will stick to to, to lose weight and is in a sustainable way so you're looking to lose around um one to two pounds a week consistently through that um you know method so that's i hope that answers that first question i don't know if um any of the doctors want to add about um metabolism as well well i mean i don't know if i can chip in Mm -hmm. uh, the, the, the same things uh, as I think in my talk with um, hypertension and um, the rest of it, where uh, inheritance, if you like, the genes mm -hmm. play a role. Mm -hmm. So in effect, you have, I think that there's a saying that um, um, the, the trigger mm -hmm. is pulled by society, whereas, you know, the gun is loaded by, by nature. So nature loads the gun and then society pulls the trigger. 
Mm -hmm. uh, that I can spend all day, you know, breaking that down. But I think mm -hmm. those who understand what I'm, you know, my inference, I think would know exactly what I'm talking about. The fact remains simple. There's nothing you can do about what you inherit because you don't choose, you know, who you were born from and whatever, what's in there, you know. But, but something you can do about is, something about is definitely is what is in your cap capability. And therefore, this business of, you know, the portions, the kind of food and the rest of it. Now, of course, you know, you might need some enlightenment, some support, you know, some prompting and all that along the way. You know, somebody who was born here would not have the same taste or quiet taste compared to somebody who was born and bred in Africa. And so you tell me, I mean, when you look at educational and sensitization and things like that, you roast uh, a lamb, you know, a whole lamb, and then you open it and give some the medium rare to the African man or woman and give the, you know, if you like, what, what is it, really well done, and you see which one would actually finish quicker. I, I don't even need to, for you to imagine what I'm talking about. That's the kind of thing. So it's a whole attitudinal change. You know, people need to be educated. People need to be told. People need to be taught. It's like, you know, you're taking it 360 degrees out because, as I said, what you eat in Africa is definitely got one taste compared to what you have here in Europe or in the Western world. And it doesn't matter what you do, there is that stark difference. And that's why I say, you know, uh, sedentary lifestyle is another thing that as we, so there's a lot of factors here. You know, metabolism, as you grow older, obviously, you slow down, yeah. and you begin to put on these and, and the way you burn the fat and the rest of it, it's mm -hmm. quite different. So, so it varies, but but as I say, by and large, trying to get those things that get that happy medium, I'm sure you'll get to somewhere that you need to be. It's as simple as that. But in terms of, you know, what you inherit, you can't do much about it. What you obviously can do much about is what you then uh, can control in terms of your portions, your your quality, mm -hmm. you know, the kind of thing. Mm -hmm. You know, high carbs, we know. High proteins, although good, but has its drawbacks. So, yeah. you know, we can debate, you know, as long as we want, but this is where things lie, you know. Things like refeeding syndrome we hear about, you know, body dysmorphic, you know, uh, 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 sim syndrome and all that. All of these, you know, affect people in various ways and all that is centered on diet and, you know, the food we consume. So what we eat can be beneficial and can be dangerous, you know, depending on how we do it. That's my, you know, chip in on that. Thank you, Uncle Doc. Yeah, um, that's great. And, and also to add to that, definitely throughout the day, there's evidence to show that your metabolism, metabolism does slow down um, as it goes, you know, towards the, the end of the day. So um, it's really important to, to really be specific with the times that you eat as well. That will help. That will help. All right, so the last bit, like I said before, when I get any advice as to if somebody worry about, say, the food and they eat it, it get infected by bacteria or yeah. whatever, how long on I go, um, or Fatima, you go advice? Well, let's mm -hmm. I, I could tell you something. They go be mm -hmm. relaxed, say, okay, whatever be did, he don't die. No, I could tell you something. I, I, Again, it's a very interesting question, and I don't think it's something we can, you know, uh, be able to... <laughs> Well, you know, conclude or maybe get something deep into. I, the, it depends on the bugs we're talking about. So, yeah, so if, for example, exactly. now we have an outbreak, I'm just thinking about that, whether that's something we need to address. There's an outbreak, they say, of anthrax. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. one of the most absolutely Whoa. difficult and resilient bugs you can think about is anthrax. Mm -hmm. Yeah, bacillus anthrax is absolutely difficult. It can lay dormant for years mm -hmm. under the soil. Yeah. Not the same as Vibrio cholera, you know, El Tor and the rest of it. Completely different. Are you with me? And mm -hmm. a, a fecal oral route, like for example, you know, who said no was that, but I tell you what, hygiene is absolutely paramount. Yeah. If you're able to wash your hands yeah. with soap, yeah, and water, <laughs> definitely the likelihood of that happening to you quite slim. I see what that, if I don't know mm -hmm. if you see that. So now we say self therefore teach that in the not to just yeah. the fact that when you cook up this, because most of the bugs then go don't go. Yeah. yeah. But the, so they were very resilient, like the spores from that rice, you know, that uh, swamp rice, the spores yeah. from them, very resistant to heat and temperature. Mm -hmm. So we, we need to understand these things. So not to just say because of, yeah. way, well, 
you know, where you cook these 50 hours or whatever. No, no, that's not it. It depends on the bug way actually affect that particular thing. Mm -hmm. So anthrax, yeah. like you say, are one of the most resilient one there. The spores when they rise. Now make you see rest. If you left them, now you, you, you call out for insect, and then when you want my normal yeah. from the middle to the outside, the likelihood mm -hmm. of getting food poisoning is quite high up there. Same as salad, any of the cold foods, you know what I mean? And very, very, yeah. you know, dangerous. You know, in the gravy, we will like now yeah. with the fish and chips, and all the in the day. You know, as I say, we can spend the whole day for talking that. But but yeah. the important thing is hygiene is paramount. Mm -hmm. It's Absolutely. as simple as that. Yeah, well, thank, thank you. you. I don't put on Adi Fatima. Yes. Over to you. That's another topic for some other day. Um, yeah. We did food safety. <laughs> we, we actually did food safety. Um, you don't do that. Yeah, you don't do that. We did don't food do safety. Um, so I don't know whether it's a reload <laughs> um, session. People in the world people don't even understand what he means. So maybe we'll yeah. get that. Maybe a reload, yeah. 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 Fumble, thank you very much. Unfortunately, we don't really go out of time now. Um, it don't be a really good session where we don't discuss a lot of things. Um regarding the the um the turnout, I'm sure a few people didn't notice. Um we go try for Silo back as a team. And review for see how we go able improve the turnout. But also, if one day in the audience when I feel something wrong, please when I make we know. Okay, so we can finish for today. So I go ask the members of the panel for let them see the last word. Then we finish for today. Okay, um, Dr. Bella, I'll start with you. Anything that we want to two people as a final word? Yes, uh, which is, um, Fatima, thank you for the for the topic. I mean, that was very very interesting. Um, uh, as you say, the um, the portion now one. Big area where people can go for the thing off and they have to get for no say. But for people that can make that mistake and say, okay, well, I they take a small portion where they eat five times for day, or they eat six times for day. That's not to be not to be right, not the right method and they and get for really get you you your regular um, eating times and make you always advise people then for eat and, and around the 10 in the morning and then around five to six in the evening, and they can get a, a small portion in between if you want for. But the main issue as well at the other side of the of the of the scale where Fatima been show as well for burn the calories. I mean if they jog one mile you burn about hundred calories. So think about it when you eat something, we get 400, 500 calories, almost miles you get for jog. Yeah, but it different to different people there. As Kai said been say, somebody can slim so they can eat boku, you know they gain with set. But on the other hand, you can realize you can get somebody we get we 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 get small bits more weight, but it's still healthy. Past that person, we slim and just to eat for kunomo and eat unhealthily. So, a healthy eating and maintaining weight and try to for, forget a certain amount of weight is okay, but not to the one that we feel safe and slim and can eat anything that's supposed to continue for eating big portion and because that is still unhealthy and then they can tell on them later on in life and um, when they don't realize because I, I, I mean a, I mean a, um, a good example of it unfortunately I think you see in pictures 20 years ago so in pictures now it's very different but thank you say and um, um, again the opportunity for realize as early as possible so that we able to exercise more and for reduce more that's a personal experience I can I can also I can also um, I can also share. Well, thank you very much, Fatima, for the for the topic on the, um, concerning the, the, the diabetes. Um, then the, uh, another topic, and that's very, that's going to be another very important topic. I will urge everybody for for invite at least two or three people. Then when they come for the list of topic, we've got diabetes now a big problem as Sierra Leone. Um, people don't realize that, but it's a very big people they die of diabetes in Sierra Leone. Um, and that's really, really, really disturbing. And diabetes, um, and it, you know, they always start with diabetes, you know? I mean, they start with, 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 with um, insulin resistance, most times, not all the time, but most of the time. And they need to buy people to get diabetes now because the um, pancreas not function again that much, you know? So um, when that topic, they come, it will very well. This has made a very, very good introduction to that topic here. And, um, 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 and TJ don't talk about the numbers, but I believe they may be now because of the football. I can, I can imagine say most people in this when they, when they celebrate at the moment. Um, 
but for the topic of diabetes, please, 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 and then we all able for at least invite three to five people in because it's a very important topic for saying that. Then we all know say well body better fast change. Thank you. That's okay. Okay, thank you so much, Fatima. Uh, a very good uh, topic. You really explain it well. The pictures are good. Uh, at least you make people for know the portion sizes them. You know, um, Dr. Bell, Dr. Kamara, don't explain about the metabolism and all the rest. Um, but just as a take home message for people there, let we know say the essence of we eating, not to only for full the belly. The food get reason why we need for it, for, for it. And I make even when they say fasting, and they allow you for like eat certain time, you know, day no more 30 days, you know, it's nothing because mm. the body in cells, them, the brain, all the components of you human being need that food and need them for form all the enzymes, then for let like you go function as a human being. So if we they cook make the food for get dentin and day, we know they get them for one specific food. That's why the portion size come into, you get forget half, 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 half or all the one and if you get them all, maybe you're not gonna need a supplementary vitamin, multiple vitamin for the take -home. because it already day in your food. So the food where we they get, if we they prepare that food day by heat with the denature, then components the day not that food day, then we defeat the purpose of getting the food in the first place. So the food body, you now they get them components then they it begin to affect you different forms. Your eyes, your brain, your everything, even to your mental health, it will affect you because they know they get them portions then they where they need for. So now we realize that, like how Dr. Kamara say, yes, people and uh, also uh, uh, Mrs. Mamu mentioned say, well, traditionally we they cook the food because we don't use dandy. Okay, maybe if we things they will need for modify, now one of them they will for modify. They we the cooking the food so long because I want to kill the box them inside that food day. If you do proper hygiene, you no need for do dandy. So you're not going to say all the food they get for the cook, they really high. You kill all the nutrients by them because you fear, say, it will get them bogged in the day. If you first, in the first place, they don't eat this food because you don't get certain outbreak, no eat them. Wash your hands, wash the food, or wash it together for you, then you're not going to need for them. The person they get today, they even a small amount, they don't get them, they don't kill all the enzymes in their body, then it will be able to live as a natural healthy eating. You know, we get the diabetes, or we get next for can talk, you know, we get most of the thing that we need for can talk. So I think that I just want to let people know as a take home message, all this first portion thing, it will help we in we own body and, and, and all. So I hope say, and the next coming topics and will be very, very good. If we, I mean, most people in a salon or in the African community, even the Asian community, diabetes is not a very common thing. You the get her, you know the no say you get her. So long we invite people them. We know if even if you get family get diabetes or in self get diabetes, let it can, it can listen. When they not come for can and treat them, but for let them know, get awareness about diabetes and how to go about her. So in two weeks' time again, hopefully we'll be able to see Una again and spread the message. So I thank you again, Fatima. I thank all the panelists and also the host. See you again in two weeks' time. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Dr. Kamar, any final word from you? Uh, I mean, uh, the colleagues, they all don't say, you know, exactly what I want to say. I say, uh, hats off and a big, big thank you to Fatima. I can always give you the fantastic session here we get for do with with food. And, you know, we all the things say food and medicine. And then we say food and poison as well. Is absolutely vital for making you understand the meaning of that. Much as you do enjoy that food, it can as well serve as something we could destroy you. So you really get to be careful. I make it important for make we take on board what you do. As I say, we start from the beginning, try for you know advise yourself, try for make we say be ambassadors 
of which you would try for praise. So practice what you preach. Now that will make people and listen to you. Other than that, well, you know, <laughs> if you don't do, now do as I say and don't do as I do kind of thing. <laughs> and you want to avoid that. You don't hear me. So, so that's the kind of thing. But be, do ya with the big people and make them understand the importance. Imagine, say, you they pay for this thing, what they do so. You know, you go meet your you GP uh, or you go meet your physician at salon or wherever, you know, uh, ask them, you know, if they're able to talk to you, like I would talk to you, so tell me. So tell maximum, I mean, we'll get GP them. Then the government will give them 15 minutes, you know, 20 minutes for talk. Here we are, we don't do one and a half hour, and I sure say anybody will listen to me understand, you know, which they gain from them talk here. So therefore, we they ask Una for make Una spread the word. If Una enjoy this, Una spread the word. If anybody get opportunity for make people forget, you know, connection na free tongue, we will go for do this thing for people and go there, even if na their remote village, as they call them, Fakai, I know by like for use that word. But if you get radio in Ayan, you go listen to me, and who knows? So in time you go for benefit from that, and then if you well, you go benefit another 20 or 30 people, and that not the essence of it. So if we manage to save one life, you know, possibly that life they go impact another 100, 200 or whatever. Pass the message on, and that's how it is. Now, now team will now perpetual benefit for all man. So remember, now one green life we get, and we all know, say well body, now in better past gentry. So dear. When I spread the word, when I join, we we ready for offer we own techno, you know, technical know-how, we knowledge. We need to get paid for that, but now this now we are sacrifice to we people. Left. So, well, body, better pass gentry. Thank you so much, Fatima, and thank you for all the people. We avoid all the football, even though, you know, City they gloat, Man United. <laughs> well, we get next season for camp, but I tell you what, you know, there's still life in the old dog yet. So, thank you so much, and God bless you all. Thank you very much, uh, Auntie Fatima. Any last final word? Um, just thank you for for all man way um you know attend this session. I hope say we go able to put um with you don't share with you um into practice. And please, yeah, when I when I share this um program with with Boku people, then as much as possible because uh, when they get you know knowledge which you know Boku people then they then they pay Boku money for. So uh, you know when I take advantage of of this um this program for sure. Um, but yeah, na na the normal one say so. Thank you all for our feedback for an attendance everything I, I really appreciate them thank you thank you very much doctor Rashid doctor, doctor online I think okay I'm as not I'm not see I'm I don't know if I can get a dot I can get the Oh, yes, that, yeah, yeah, true. Nah, that puts it. Yeah, that cool. That cool. Look at that. Look at that. Doctor Rashid, um, for the one away, not be done with Doctor Rashid. Um, I'll be a medical student, but fortunately for me, you know, my full medical doctor, um, yeah. you know, if I may say a few words to people, I'm okay shy, but they, we don't catch up. <laughs> so that's what I see the answer. Oh, look at that. Big round of applause. Congratulations. 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 Yeah, thank you very much, everybody.